Kate Middleton has one diva-like request for flight attendants, but maybe it's not that weird. It seems like everyone is obsessed with how the royal family travels lately. After the huge blow-up over Prince Harry and Meghan Markle using private jets while complaining about climate change, it's enough to make the whole royal family look like a bunch of hypocrites. A few days after the whole private jet fiasco, Prince William and Kate Middleton were spotted traveling on a commercial flight, which some royal followers thought was done intentionally to send a statement. But in reality, the two trips were likely scheduled months in advance and the private flight versus commercial flight comparisons were just a coincidence. However, Kate Middleton is making headlines once again due to some apparent diva-like requests she has for flight attendants on the commercial plane she does take. But are her demands really that strange? Royals don't travel like the rest of us. On their most recent trip to Africa, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle knew that the stakes were high and everything had to go right during the royal tour? That's why there was really no question that they'd be taking a commercial flight to get there not a private plane. But just because they flew British Airways, it doesn't mean there's a chance you could get seated next to Prince Harry on the plane, even if you were lucky enough to fly first class. That's because high-ranking royals like Prince William, Prince Harry, and their families get special treatment even when they fly on commercial airlines. Instead of standing in security lines, Royals get to wait in a lounge before boarding the plane and get private security and passport checks there. Then they can board the plane first and disembark last so they don't need to interact with the rest of the people on the flight. Kate Middleton has one strange request whenever she flies. The current rumors going around about Kate Middleton say that she exhibits Steve-like behavior on flights by insisting that her dresses have their own seats on the plane. Royal correspondent Emily Andrews explained that she's witnessed this behavior firsthand. I've been on a plane where all Kate's dresses had their own seat, to make sure they were kept flat, Andrews said. They are not going to be shoved in the hole just to be squashed by everyone else's. It does seem like an unnecessary demand, especially on a crowded flight when space is at a premium. But is the Duchess of Cambridge really acting like a spoiled brat? Those plane seats would be empty anyway. One bonus of flying commercial for the royal family is they often purchase all the seats in one section or row to maintain their privacy. So the fact that Kate Middleton's dresses are occupying one of those seats shouldn't be too shocking. Especially when you consider that certain airlines allow any passengers, even those in coach, to stash their wedding gowns in first class if they happen to be traveling with them. The Duchess of Cambridge makes a living being photographed during appearances, so it makes perfect sense that she'd be super conscious of wrinkling her expensive dresses. And if she paid for the seat anyway, there's no reason to get offended that she uses it for her wardrobe. At least she's not taking a private jet, right?